Hello Virgo. So this is the preview of the month of January. This reading, I'm going to be using the spread that I usually use for the weekly, but it's going to be for the month of January. So let's see what's going on. Okay. Universe, let's look at your energy between Virgos and the person that's on Virgo mind for general oh, have a card already queen of pentacles so i see you guys are in your power this is capricorn season that's your fellow earth energy okay so and then i got king of wands so you guys are connecting with a uh, masculine fire sign universe the person that's on virgo mind we would like to say to virgo three of pentacles eight of swords six of cups okay so what they would like to say um i feel like somebody is trying to get on your good side again um they would like to say they was not thinking right. They was acting stupid, okay? And they want to reconnect, okay, with these three cards here. Three of Pentacles, Six of Cups. Universe, the person that's on Virgo mind, why are they keeping hidden from Virgo? Okay. The sun, okay, the truth. So, yeah, they're going to still be BSing. They're not going to really admit to the truth. Universe, the person that's on Virgo mind, how do they feel about Virgo for January 2022? The Chariot, Ace of Cups. Yep, they're moving. They want to move forward with you. Okay. Yeah, they had someone else in the picture. Um, especially if you was dealing with a Cancer. Cancer here. Some Leo. Universe, the person that's on Virgo mind. What is their true feelings for Virgo? Seven of Swords, Ace of Wands. Yeah, they were the bull. Wow. So I feel like this person is very attracted to you, but they're not really authentic. Okay, they're they're really not. Universe, the person that's on Virgo Mind, what is their intentions with Virgo for January 2022? Universe, the person, Page of Swords, the Lovers. Yeah, they're just trying to, their intention is for you to, to not go anywhere. They don't want you to move forward with someone else. So their intention is for you to be like kind of cock blocking. Okay. Um, that's what I'm seeing. Universe, the person that's on Virgo mind. What actions would they take with Virgo for January 2022? Hangman. The action is basically to just keep you stuck and confused. Okay. That's what I'm seeing. So this is someone who just likes to be us. Um yeah, it could be cancer, strong cancer energy. This is someone like when their love life is not good. They come back just to like me like mess up with your healing, mess up with you progressing, okay? Their intention is really bull, like BS, okay, if this is resonating. Um, the sign of this person, like I was mentioning, strong cancer energy. Could be a Leo too, Cancer Leo Cups. There's some Gemini, okay? Heavy summer energy. So I don't know if you guys broken up during the summertime, um... They're born during the summertime. Okay. Let's clarify the hangman more. Let's see. Universe, clarify the hangman. The hermit. Okay. Yeah, it's to keep you confused, to keep you in your head. That's the actions of why they're returning. Now, we are in Venus in retrograde. So, and it's an earth sign. It's in Capricorn. So, earth signs might get affected by this. Um, so, it could be why this person's resurfacing as well. Not why, but... It could be influencing why this person want to come back. So let's see what else I'm getting. So let's look at this deck. Okay, universe, give me a four card spread. What's going to happen in Virgo's love life for January 2022? So there is Taurus and Gemini. Stay focused. Remember where you started. The Two of Cups. Universe, give me my card. The Tower. Yep. So this is going to be a shake-up, a test for you. Okay. When this person returns. I feel like this is the person that you always had like an on and off connection. That's the person that's going to resurface. But the universe is throwing you a test to see like, you know, have you completely learned your lesson. Okay. Don't get distracted by this. Like again, I feel like this is someone who... They're like Diaz. Like, they're really trying to throw you off. So, let's see. 
let's look i guess let's look here first okay so universe you have four cards spread well okay i got a couple cards so there's prostitute detective storyteller well what's going on here <laughs> this um deck have random messages but i took credit when it comes to love so i feel like the prostitute it just mean that they was for the community they had other people and you probably found out about that um and probably your friends family members was telling you about this okay you probably even had a dream with the guy that they're, they're for the community let's see what else we're getting universe clarify companion monk nun yeah i feel like this was you i feel like you guys was like really loyal to them and it was out here. It was for the community. So let's look here. All right, universe. Give me a three card spread. What messages do you have for Vert? So there's change. There's loneliness. I guess what else I'm getting. Universe, give me one more card regret yeah so yeah the universe is testing i feel like it's testing the virgos who's kind of missing someone okay it's testing but I feel like a lot of you guys are gonna like pass this test okay so this is just a test the universe is throwing at you to see are you ready for the next part of your um life or are you want to continue to repeat a cycle that's insane okay let's look at what they would like to say Universe, the person that's on Virgo mind, what would we like to say to Virgo for January? Discipline, empathy, and happiness. So what they would like to say is that, you know, they was happy being with you. They are more um, consistent. They will be more consistent, I mean. Um, they understand what they, what had happened, the pain. Okay, they also would say they was afraid to actually love you. Okay, let's see what else I'm getting. universe give me a four card spread what messages do you have for virgos so there is material harvest deception and envy third eye chakra wow some of you guys have been getting psychic attack wow yeah wow so i feel like this test is gonna happen and I don't feel like it's only only this person is serving as a test. I feel like there's going to be something that's going to serve as a test outside of this person too. That, mo this, that month is going to be very critical for you guys. So really be focused. Don't get tempted by anything at all. Um, don't. Because that's a, that's a very important month. Okay? January is a very important month for you guys. Um, you got to stay focused and stay strong okay do not get tempted because i feel like there's gonna be something that's going to serve as a test um something that you overcome but the universe trying to see if you really overcome that okay and that's when, when you pass that test it's gonna lead to a breakthrough okay that's what i'm seeing all right chakra okay let's look here let's look at the angel answers Like universe, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for Virgos? You're ready. Recovery. Take action in the near future. And no need to worry. Yep. So it's going to be that month is gonna be that breakthrough month. But you really have to stay focused and you can't like you can't repeat certain things. It's it's telling you to not repeat something, especially for that month. Because it's called breakthrough month. I feel like it's really a breakthrough month for you, okay? I see that. Okay, so universe, give me a two-card spread. What messages do you have for Virgos for January 2022? Universal messages you have for Virgos for January 2022. So there is fearless self love. Universe, give me one more card. And that's a master number. Some of you guys are fellow master number 22. 
Universe, give me one more card. This is a big lesson that you're mastering. Then there's time of fallow. And then there's savoring the positive. I allow myself the spaciousness of savoring the delicious gifts in my life. So continue to think positive. Whenever I choose to love myself, no matter the circumstances surrounding me, I'm practicing fearlessness. Okay, make sure you put yourself first. I know Virgo is the sign of the, you know, the sign of service. But make sure you do put yourself first. Okay, I'm taking care of you first too. Time of fallow, creative manifestation occurs more easily when I have nurtured myself and honor my time of fallow. Okay, so that's the reading that I have for you Virgos. Thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing and Merry Christmas. If this video resonates, you can definitely book a personal reading with me at QueenFitterTarot at gmail.com.